density of 3,500 cubic meters per hour is adopted for the harbor basin and tombing circle dredging. The terminal land area is reclaimed by the suitable dredged material. Temporary construction yard is established on the east side of the south container terminal after the land area is reclaimed. And then the temporary site office, living quarters, Kaisong precasting yard will be constructed. Rock material is transported by 30 to 50 cubic meter hopper and placed over the excavated footprint. The riprap work is carried out layer by layer and the compaction work is carried out by using 5 ton ramming boat. Footprint leveling is carried out by the driver using the scraping rod with rock material supplied by the string device and a 200 ton barge is allocated to support the operation. The pre-casting work of Kaisan is executed layer by layer. The bottom shuttering consists of structural steel, timber deck, and fiberboard. Reinforcement bars will be fabricated over the bottom shuttering. Further, the props will be used for reinforcement work. Put the vertical steel bar for cross bulkhead, then the horizontal reinforcement. Both the outer shuttering and inner shuttering are steel structure combination formwork. Gantry crane is allocated for installation and removal of formwork. Meanwhile, the concrete mixer and pump truck are used to support the concrete work. Both the land transport and water transport are used for Kaisan transportation. First Kaisan is transversely shifted to the vertical way and longitudinally shifts to 4200 ton semi-submersible barge by using gas bag. Second, the suitable tugboat is allocated to drag the Kaisan to submergence location, then to installation location after semi-submersible barge submerge and filling water to Kaisan up to buoyant stability condition. With a 2,000 ton barge as the locating barge, two hoists and four chain blocks are allocated to support the first Kaisan installation. Installation of second Kaisan is carried out by virtue of the first completed Kaisan. With the supporting of two hoists and four chain blocks, the rest of the Kaisans shall be done in the same manner. This 100 kilowatt vibroflotation machine is used for ground treatment. The locations of the vibrofloats arrangement will be like the vertices of equilateral triangle of 3500 cubic meters side. The formwork of the breast wall is made of steel, which is assembled by crane. The reinforcement work shall be carried out on site, and the breast wall shall be poured by two layers in situ concrete. The key surface concrete shall be poured line by line of each section. The track beam is 60 meter length for each section, which is poured in situ after erection of reinforcement. The barge is used to dump the rock for the underlayer, whose level is below minus 2.0 meters. The rest part, which is over minus 2.0 meters, will be carried out from the land. After the completion of ground treatments, the construction sequence of horizontal direction shall be from the west to the east and from the south to the north. The construction sequence of vertical direction shall be fire control and water supply work. 